Okay, so just a quick update on my non robot D6 Plus. I've just cleaned it a bit because I last time I did it, I rode it was uh, in the bush. And it was pretty muddy everywhere. Uh, still thing, but I notice on this one, this looks like an 11 inch tire. Eh? I and it does say it's tubeless. Uh, no, nope, it says 10 inch by 3 inch. The funny thing is, when I compare it to the let's just say my inner can here. That tire looks bigger than this one when you look at it closely, but anyway, looks looks the same, I suppose. But it does say that this is a tubeless tire, which is uh, interesting. I didn't know that this uh, comes with a tubeless tires, and I don't know how that works. Um, but it says tubeless right there. Interesting. Alright, so that's the front suspensions. They're pretty stiff like, compared to my 10X. Um, but anyway, I was gonna... So what I did, I got 46.5 kilometers on this. And that's going on heavy terrain. Um, full on... Um, heavy off-road terrain uh, in the mountains and I used it that and in the full battery lasted before around that just close to 47 kilometers so yeah it, 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 it's pretty good uh, and yeah it took took a long time before the battery dies out I was really tired um, and I had to take a break a few, a few times. Just can't hack standing up and going through that terrain. Lots of bumps and the this scooter handled the terrain very good. And these shocks are very beefy. Look at that. And they're upset about the softer setting because I'm actually very light at 60 kilos. the beef ones anyway uh, that's a quick update my non-robot d6 i've just changed the uh, the grip tape